minutes. I have three items I want to go over. Did you state, state your name after you said Cheryl, your address? Cheryl Bass, 289 Main Street. <laughs> Within five minutes, I just want to uh, go over three items. Number one, that the building where the EMS uh, were was uh, ruined. Number two, the current regulations. And number three, uh, the Affordable Care Act. I'll get to number one at the end. Uh, number two, current regulations. The numbers that we were given is based on the current regulations that take care of the emergency medical. So we got from the years 2011 uh, up to uh, the current time, how much, uh, so to say, revenue comes in. And uh, we're a small town. The economies of scale are such that we have to have the equipment, but the demographics are such that we have a smaller population. So uh, percentage-wise, so to say, we'll say percentage-wise, we're expending a lot of tax dollars to make sure that everything is covered, even though the population is smaller. Okay, number three, the Affordable Care Act. Everything changed because this year so many new regulations and laws went into effect that the EMT uh, has to meet all of these new uh, monies, these new uh, costs, these new uh, regulations. And uh, as you were saying, the two doctors have to sign off on something. Years ago it was one doctor. One doctor, uh, the, the Affordable Care Act is unaffordable in Spotswood. So uh, that takes care of that. But let me dwell on number one. Uh, 2011, Hurricane Irene. 2012, Hurricane Sandy. The building was destroyed. And from that time, when we had former Mayor Thomas Barlow here, he said we had the 100-year flood. And then the following year, we didn't even have to wait 100 years. We had the hur uh, Hurricane Sandy, which was even more devastating than the 100-year uh, hurricane. And after that, he decided he's not going to be the mayor anymore. And that was enough for him. On the, uh, on the website, the uh, mayor uh, issued a letter. There was also a letter from the uh, president of the town council. The mayor says in his letter, the borough council is under the impression that Spotswood EMS is supposed to be a money maker. I do not agree with that one bit. There is nobody on the council who considers the EMS as a money making item. This is taxpayer dollars being expended for the life and death of the residents. Just as the gentleman was saying, this is a life and death matter, so money is not the main issue. The mayor goes on in his letter, and he says uh, that he's lo uh, looking to be uh, transparent, give us numbers, against the wishes of the borough council. Once again, I do not believe that that has any bearing whatsoever in this particular matter. Uh, the mayor was put into office because everything comes from the mayor's office, uh, leadership, authority, and uh, all of the power to do things. The building was ruined in 2011, Cheryl. and from that point forward, it was never put back in service. We have three expenses, a new building, meeting up with the current expenses, and now uh, taking care with the Affordable Care Act. Thank you, Cheryl.